Oscar-nominated character actor Frederick Forrest, who starred in The Rose and Apocalypse Now, has died. He was 86. His former co-star Bette Midler took to Twitter to share the sorrowful news. Actor Barry Primus told The Hollywood Reporter Forrest died Friday at his home in Santa Monica after a long illness. Primus had helped raise money last year for his caregiving expenses. Forrest's representatives could not immediately be reached for comment. Midler and Forrest starred in the Janis Joplin-inspired flick, The Rose, 1979, the actress playing a troubled rock star and the late actor portraying her limousine driver turned love interest, Houston Dyer. The role earned Forrest Academy Award and Golden Globe nominations for Best Supporting Actor. Also in 1979, he starred as J. Chef Hicks in the Francis Ford Coppola classic, Apocalypse Now, alongside Robert Duvall, Martin Sheen and Marlon Brando. Born on December 23, 1936, in Waxahachie, Texas, Forrest grew up shy, too nervous to audition for school plays. He earned a minor in theater arts and a major in radio and television studies at Texas Christian University before heading to the Big Apple to study under Sanford Meissner, an accomplished actor and teacher. He performed in various off-Broadway productions, including, Viet Rock, Silhouettes, and, Futs. When he eventually moved west to Los Angeles, he was cast in, When Legends Die, 1972, which earned him a Golden Globe nomination for Most Promising Newcomer, after director Stuart Miller saw his performance in Clifford Odets, Waiting for Lefty. Following the success of The Rose and Apocalypse Now, he appeared in several other projects through the early 2000s, with his last on-screen appearance in All the King's Men in 2006. He was married to Nancy Ann Whitaker from 1960 to 1963 and actress Mary Lou Henner from 1980 to 1983.